we're going to talk about how to get smoother lines in Clip Studio Paint. And this applies to either EX or Clip Studio Paint Pro. Whenever you click on any of your drawing tools over here, you will notice under your tool properties, you have a stabilization option. Under the stabilization option, uh, if I don't, the default is different. Every time you click on a brush, it'll switch over to whatever the last setting was. When it's low, say it's zero, and I'm gonna zoom in here next to my off-brand Batman. As I draw, you'll see it's a little wobbly. It's picking up every little bit of variance in my line. Now I've inked traditionally for professionally for over 10 years and I can get a very smooth line. And if I do the same thing, it, this is a little different. Um, there's a lot going on. This is the program translating your movement into the line and you won't get, if it's at zero, as smooth a line as you would if you did that same movement by hand. So how do we fix that? So we can take this up and start inching it up a little bit. We can take it up to, let's say, maybe 10 or 12 on that one. You know, it starts getting a little bit smoother. Now, 12 is decent. If I take it all the way up to 100, you'll see it lags a little bit. Yes, it's a very smooth line, but you can see it trails behind me because it's having to process that. So as you're drawing a page, that can get very, very annoying. So you want to find a happy medium and you really don't need to be 100. I usually find that most brushes, and again, it interacts with, uh, every brush is different and every pencil is different. But for the most part, um, if you set it around maybe 19 or 20, it usually does pretty good. The, of course, the bigger the brush size, the more information it has, but that one actually doesn't do too bad right there. So if you're looking for smoother lines, play with the stabilization, see what your computer can handle, and try to get it as low as you can to get the line you're looking for without having to over-process. And if there's a line that you just, one line that you just want really smooth, of course, you can always just bump it up and then back down. So that is what stabilization does. If you're having problems getting wobbly lines that you just aren't getting when you normally draw on paper, that's probably why you have to play with this setting right here. And again, it, it applies to every one of the drawing tools from the brush all the way up here, even on the eraser. Hope that helps. If there's any other tutorials in Clip Studio Paint that you'd like to see, let me know in the comments. And thanks for watching.